and welcome back YouTube. This is Eclectic Andrew with Cecil, Rosa, Kane, Edge, and Raidia. Today, we end this. We end the war. We're gonna finish Final Fantasy IV. This will be the end of the cycle of vengeance. Ah, oh, here's one of those throwaway bosses I told you about. It's a uh, Zenus's breath. It's uh, just gonna start scanning you. It's not really gonna do anything to harm you. It's just here to say, hey, Zemus, they're coming to you. Yes, we're coming for you. Coming to end the cycle. Coming to end the evil. Uh, 50,000 gold, okay. Uh, no experience. Not enough to level up Rosa and learn holy. Holy crap. All right, just before the end of the game, we learn we learn holy. We've not learned flare yet, which is sad. Okay, you ready, Cecil? Everybody, are you ready? Look at the symmetry. Gobez, Fusuya. Hey, the fighting Zemus. All right. Whoa, no damage. Come on, Gobez, you're a better black wizard than that. Fusuya is using white magic for some odd reason. Come on. Deep. Stop trying to CC him. He's not even doing anything. He knows what his breath does. His breath does more damage than... Does more work than he does. Alright, that did more damage. Cast me yo now! Ready. Alright. Die trying. Oh, double Meteo. Sweet. A fusion spell. The body dies. But the spirit lives on. I'm sure we'll do more work than you do. Maybe your mind will be more at work than your, bo your body, huh? It's not that this is the greatest city in the world. Alright, Lopez, Lucia, defeated Zemus. The evil is done. It is done. What waste. A man of such power to be consumed with evil. Right on! Haha! <laughs> hey! And celebrate. We meet again. Shucks, you guys beat me to it. Cecil. Uh, really? You're still sad? You're here. Cecil! Uh, Zemus, what are you doing? Whoa. He just burst into flames. Wait, he's a flame, and now it's grown darker. I am the incarnation of Zemus's enemy. Zeremus, the absolute darkness, the epitome of hate. Whoa. Whoa, guys. Death only increased Zemus's hatred. Zemus, or should I say Zeremus, I shall destroy you once and for all. Your hatred ends with us. Whoa. Hey, when did you learn Meteo? Yes. Whoa, that healed him. Uh, guys, use the fusion Meteo. Stop doing it individually. You're healing him. Meteo is useless? Use the crystal. Crystal? Crystal. Whoa, look at that, that's nice. The crystal. It is eclipsed. In the hands of darkness. It is no use. Oh no, it knows Meteo too. I guess everybody knows Meteo now. 
agony. Death. Hatred to rage on until all dies. No. Cecil, don't let it all die. Don't you die. If you fall here, it's all gonna die. Everyone. Elder! We gotta do something. It is time. We must pray for them. We must pray for the world. Alan, poor him. We shall send everybody's prayers to Cecil. Cecil. Pray, show us your courage once more. We're all waiting for you. Please return safe. Return peace to Mother Earth. Please stand up. For our last hope. Come on, bro. Everyone, please. <clears throat> Moon of the Heavens, receive our prayers. Oh, man. Cecil, can you feel it? The light of the world below you is reviving you, isn't it? Brother. Cecil. Here, use this. Pistol? Zero miss. We won't fall here. For all life, and for those who give their lives, we will not lose. This is awesome. Got this, bro. Oh. Please accept this. I give you life. Everyone, rise up. You're not on your knees any longer. You are all sort of fatal. Tella? I hope this helps. Trust in your power. They give you strength. Even tell us spirit is here. Because he gave his life too to the cycle of vengeance. We must end this here. He wants us to end it here just as much as we do. Keep your focus. Come home soon. They give you vitality. So what about you? What? Even Fusuya and Gomez are giving you their prayers too. You must prevail. Brother. With your holy power, trust the crystal. Zero miss, show yourself. Wipe away the facade of flame. Cecil, let's do this. The crystal should be somewhere in the items. Here it is. Let's see what happens. The holy power of Paladin, Lunarian. Wipe away the flames. In Zermas, he reveals himself. I honestly think using Polly is a bad idea on him, but I'm gonna try it anyways. Ooh, this is the strongest move, the Big Bang. Sorry, it's a little after left there. Whoa, right here. Uh, do -do -do -do. Don't waste, uh... 
No, maybe I should have wasted a versus a using life too. Whoa, holy crap. Yeah, that causes an encounter with the weak tornado spell. Whoa, what do you mean you lost too much HP? Oh, uh, I think Big Bang causes a... No, use the knife. I think Big Bang causes a draining effect. Okay, okay, what do we do, what do we do, what do we do? Oh, oh crap. I think I just died. Son of a bee. We are manned and outgunned. Outnumbered and outplanned. <laughs> we are not making all out sand here. Let's use Rose to uh, use life too, and I failed. No. Pain, you should be able to withstand this. Come on. Guys. No, not Bio. Son of a... <sighs> Welcome back, YouTube. This time we're gonna get it. I'm gonna make sure we're gonna get it. We're gonna get it, get it good. And here we go, Cecil, using the Crystal of Light on Zeromus to reveal his true form, his true demonic alien self. <laughs> Wow, he has phlegm. Okay, we're gonna have Edge throw his strong- the three strongest items I have at the moment. They're the ones I did a little testing on make sure which ones were stronger and stronger, or weaker, and loved up Rydia, got Flare. It's pretty nice. Oh no, he used Flare on her. Huh, your Flare is not as good as hers. Uh oh, big bang. Oh well. Well, I did have Kane jump, but that's just for the first first turn. I'm gonna have Edge keep throwing those last three items, and Kane and Edge are gonna take over item duty. They're gonna be our supply routers. They're gonna hold our supplies. They're gonna bring them out to us and use them. And this main bat main battle arena is gonna be basically just Cecil, Rosa, and Rydia. They're the three that I'm counting on to survive the Big Bang and survive the apocalypse against this dreaded evil, evil thing. <clears throat> oh yeah, let's heal Rydia up for the Big Bang. That sounds good. Haha, <laughs> now she'll survive the Big Bang and be able to use Flare against you over and over again, over again, Zeromus. Okay, he's countering Flare with Flare. Oh. Well, that elixir didn't matter. Oh well. We'll bring her back next time. Because Edge, I believe you just threw the knife, the kitchen knife, so you're on item duty now. Bring back your favorite girl. Rosa will heal all of us from the black from the Big Bang. And the black hole. All it should have done was nullify the slow I used on him at the beginning. I need to use a... Oh. Well, I'm about to try to use a Bacchus Wine on Cecil, and I failed because I forgot that it's a self-use item. And then I also doubly forgot Cecil is immune to Berserking because of his armor. So, he's not gonna... Be berserk. He's not gonna do more damage, all because of his armor. How an armor protects you from being berserk, confused, and charmed, and all the wily, wily ways your mind can f you up. Eh, too bad you don't keep that on through the rest of your life, Cecil. <laughs> so long as we end the cycle of vengeance, doesn't matter what happens to me. Yeah. Uh, Edge, I don't think I need to use you as an item, even though I have Kane that I wanted on item duty. So we're gonna have Edge stand packed. Rosa be ready to heal for the Big Bang. 
Oh wow, Sussy, you have 4,000 HP, I never realized. Oh, huh, cool. Oh, Edge. Whoa, Edge, you have 3,000 HP, that's rare. Like, I know Rydia is still, uh, technically has the lowest HP, but so many LPs technically has um, Edge have lower HP because of the level gap between him and everybody else. Man, there's just really nothing I can do. Why didn't I at least take my sword and stab him in the frickin' face? Come on, Eclectic Andrew, think! Rydia! Oh... Oh no... Well, I'm gonna heal... Cecil's sword... Smash his face in with the sword! And... <laughs> oh, don't steal Edge. No need to steal anything from him, it's... A very rare item, it's a single item, but it's a... Uh, single item in the game, but... Whatever. It, it's the final battle, we're not gonna get to use it or anything. I mean, unless we, like, in the final fight against Kafka, in that climb up to the... to Kafka, off that, uh... evil tower of... that evil monument of... Nihilism he has, where we can steal some good items, good weapons from him and equip them right on our people before we finish the game. You know, actually I just realized, because uh, if your characters die in between stages of that game, and they fade away and re get replaced with the next person in line, so you can steal those items in order to equip the people with those strong items that you probably only had equipped in your strongest people, which may have already died. Wow. Uh, I think we're gonna use an elixir on Rose-Ridea here. Maybe life two on edge. Yeah, Octane. Elixir time. Hmm. Elixir, elixir. Oh, you going for the big stuff now, right? Uh huh? Yeah. Let's bring out all the big guns. All arms to bear. Hmm. Well, let's wait to see, because he also conquers Mega Fire. Mega Fire with Flare. Oh, he's using Bio even. Oh, that's horrible. Let's heal. Oh, yeah, Cecil, let's have you use an item before the Big Bang. Yay. I'll, I'll use an elixir. Whoops. Wrong person. Yeah, yeah, I'll say. Oh, well, at least he heals our MP. That's nice. Bye, Edge. Bye. Ah. Fade to shadows. Fade into the shadows of time. Whoa. Too much lost HP. Need to heal. Super need to heal. Come on, Baumut, take him out. Huh, your black hole is mean meaningless. All it does is take off the spider silk we used earlier. You know, that's a good reason why it's uh, not very good idea to use defensive spells. Whoa, Meteor. Well, at least he's gonna miss a lot. He does not have the best magic accuracy with Meteor. Mmm, Elixir. Sure, Rosa. Bahamut. Bahamut. Life 2, yeah. That's why you use Life 2, because when the Big Bang comes... You need Life 2 to have survived it. Mega Fire! Oh, yes! Yes! Defeat of evil. Breaking the cycle. You are the weakest link, Zermus. Goodbye. Oh, poor Edge. 
This is such a cool background, though. Good thing you don't fade away in this. Only Zero Miss is fading away. Fade. Sink. Goodbye. Oh, you're taking your sweet old time. Oh, there it goes. Oh. Eh. Takes a lot of en releasing a lot of energy to break up evil vengeance. I will not perish. So long as evil dwells in the hearts of mankind. We don't care for your evil ways. We'll stand against you every time. Even, even Gobez and Fusaya will stand after being defeated and rise against you. When you're living on your knees, you rise up. Go fade into nothingness. Back to the nothingness you came from. Well done. Thank you. Your powers have far exceeded my expectations. Indeed, your race has come far. Oh, is that why you didn't invite us along when you initially left? Transcended ours, perhaps? Yeah, we rule. Yeah, maybe we do rule, Fusia. Zero misses last words. What do you think? As long as evil dwells in the hearts. In every heart, there resides good and evil. Mind and matter. Just as the crystals of light and dark exist, just as the overworld and underworld together form the earth, against evil will, good will arises. Darkness rises, then light rises to meet it. I was nothing. I was born a hero. When I was born, I didn't just cry. I cried thunder. Wah! Yeah. Could you be more arrogant? I'm surprised he must didn't control you. Hey, never me. I'm all righteousnessness. That's a word, right? I must go now and sleep along with my people. And you? We are going home. Our friends are waiting. Ah, uh, yes, you are truly blessed with fine companions. I look forward to your next meeting, our next meeting even. I wish to accompany you. You? I cannot go back. Not after what I've done. Come on, I'll respect you for turning over a leaf and owning up to what you've done. Don't run away after all. Oh, how far you've come? That's just, that's, that's not how you... Dying is easy, living is harder. And I long to know more about the Lunarians, my father's people. Huh, yeah, it's not too bad any, a reason to go with Fusaya and go with the Lunarians. You are a Lunarian. Ah, uh, yes, you are half Lunarian. A long sleep awaits us, mind you. I have no qualms. Sleep bears foam. Long dreams comes nightmares, Fuse uh, Golbez. Be careful. You called me brother. I have caused you much pain. I cannot expect your forgiveness. He did kind of cross a few lines there, but... You don't need everybody to forgive you. Fare you well. We shall pray for peace on Earth. And a Merry Christmas to you all. Good night. Come. Yes. Cecil. So that's it. 
He's your brother. <sighs> Farewell. Cecil. <clears throat> Cecil? Goodbye, brother. Aw, like, like, like a proud Goron. <sighs> Thank you, Cecil. Aw. It does almost feel like that's not the end of this between the two of them. There needs to be more between the two of them. There needs to be good, good, honest, open di dialogue between them. But yes, that is the end of Final Fantasy IV. I'm no longer playing, it's all just going on its own. Here we get to look over the solar system, the first three planets of the solar system of... Mercury, Venus, and Earth, with two moons. One born of a dragon, bearing darkness and light, shall rise to the heavens over the still land. Bathing the moon in eternal light, he brings a promise to Mother Earth with bounty and grace. But someday the moon shall depart, seeking its own light. The sons of moon and earth shall then part, divided by the flow of time. Oh no, one's gonna grow older while the other one grows younger. So old do I look to your eyes? Spinning in space. That sun is really, really flickery. <laughs> na, 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 na. Rest lunar whale. Forever. Now, for today's lesson. Yes, Elder. Uh, where is Pelham? Oh, not again. <sighs> wow, he's just hanging out at the riverside. Yep, that's when I cast ice and bam, bam. I made that. I made that dish well. Oh, whack! Ow! Get back to the house. The elder is very angry. And you wouldn't like him when he's angry. Ah. Uh, and you expect to become the next Tella. Transcribe 1,000 spells by tonight. Aw. Just like Bart Simpson. No. Get to work. What are you going to do all night? All night poor, I'm just slack off? No. Your Highness, as the heir to the throne, you must exercise more prudence. Stop lifting up every girl's skirt. Stop nagging me. I know. Ah, ah. Sit down, then from here on you will refrain from courting ladies every day. And especially slapping their bottoms. Yeah, yeah. Please stop with those lazy answers. Ah, here's how lazy I'm walking around you. Damn, right you. No girl in this world compares to you. Oh, edges in love. With sassy little green right you. That's sweet. Your Highness. Nah. Run away. She has boundless potential. Yes, I never imagined she would return. Right, yeah. Uh, I was wondering, why do I have fangs? I don't want fangs. I wish I were like you. Aw, poor little kid. 
listen to me. Humans and summons look different, but we're the same. She brings a new life to our land. And beauty. Young human beauty. Ah. Uh. Uh, you're beautiful too. You and I have the same heart. That's all that matters. Aw. Yang, you're sitting in the throne. Your wife is dancing. Han, I don't like this one bit. Stay calm. You are a queen now. And stop addressing me as Han. All this formality crap's making my neck stiff. Oh, I must go. Go? Go where? It is time for training. Yeah! Han, get your butt back here. Now, now, Yang is striving to build a new Fabul. Are you Cursus Alba? Curses. Are, is the construction going well? Yes, my king. Are you well? Is everyone taking care of themselves? Yes, king. Are you well? Hey, prince, even. Play us the paladin song. All right, but first we have work. We need to rebuild the castle as soon as possible, right? Yeah, okay. See you later. Uh huh. Uh, Anna. Watch over me. I'll bring happiness to my people. What about courage? Courage and love. Take care of Tella. She told you to share your love and courage with the world. Ralio! Begin work. The castle needs much fixing. Rally, rally! King, king, king! We rally need more seal! Uh, where are you gonna get that? Scrap the tanks! No more wars! No need for them! Oh, come on. You don't know that something's not gonna rise up out of the, the ocean of lava you have down here. Father, have you heard from Cecil? Good news! Cecil and Rosa will rule Baron as king and queen! Really? 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 We are going to the coronation! Yay! King, 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 we really need more tanks to scrap. Hmm, well, well, then I got it. Scrap the swords and armor. Rally, oh, no more war. Whoa, is that Cain? Cain, is that you? Cecil, Rosa, forgive me. I can't give me you my blessing. I will train here at Ordeals to surpass my father, and return someday as a worthy dragoon. Maybe then... Cain? What's wrong? What the... Did I even ever go here? Huh? No, I'm not sure I went here, I'm sorry. What? Oh my gosh! The moon! The moon is out! What's that from? I forget. The moon? Of course the moon is out. It's the moon. It's in the sky. It rises and sets. It waxes and it waxes and it wanes. It spins in space. Oh, I know. It's, um... Taka. Waka, yeah, Waka. Okay. <laughs> More spinning in space. Uh, the moon? <gasps> the moon is not spinning. It's going in a straight line away from Earth. 
Now Earth has one moon instead of two. Whatever shall we do? Cecil. <gasps> what? Cecil. What? What? You're scaring Rosa. What's wrong? Nothing. I thought I heard my brother. What did he say? It was just my imagination. Come on, Cecil, she's your beloved. Share with her. Oi, what the hell's taking so long? You're holding up the show. Sorry. Hey, two beds now, yay. Save the hanky pank until after the ceremony. Come on, Rosa. Oh, wait, do I have to call you queen from now on? Oh. No, please don't. So I'm still your daddy, right? I can't give her the bride away until... Line moves, and she puts on some makeup. The maids are waiting for you. I'll be right down. Everyone will be here soon. I can't wait to see them. Yeah. I did hear him. He said... Goodbye. You sure that's all he said, Cecil? You're being awfully secretive for being a paladin. What's wrong with you? Bring the truth to light, Cecil. Hey. Huh. Time for the coronation and the wedding. Or the wedding coronation. Everyone's arriving. There's a bride's... Oh, wait. Sid's on, on the left. He's on... He should be on the right with Rosa, because he's her daddy. Well, I guess that makes sense. He walked her down the aisle, and... She went to the right, he went left, just because it's more convenient, but... Aww. Hey, cool chair! Pelham! Get out of the throne! Good evening. Aww. Hey, pretty lady! Come on! Aww. This is so nice. Knights of the... Knights of the castle, mages of the castle, our best friends coming. We're having a real party here, Cecil. Is there gonna be a buffet? Or is it a stout meal? Hmm, I wonder if there's crab legs. Oh, that reminds me so much of Lucajin and Maseanella. Because uh, when Luca Jin got married to John, they had a bunch of crab legs at their wedding. And they, Masay and Nella and Luca Jin almost ate out the restaurant or the wedding hall or whatever of all their crab legs. Oh, I forgot to turn on the power. Do not worry about that, what I just said there, YouTube. It's uh, just a. Uh... Wait, what's this? Squaresoft. Wait, was that the end of the- They're re- What? They're just replaying the opening scene? Are they? No, this has to be the end. It's a victory lap around the world. Right? Wait, Dark Knight? Rosa- Oh! Okay, I guess it's the end of Final Fantasy IV. On the PlayStation, what's this? What is this? Oh, it's the crystal room of Tower of Babel. Okay. Odin? Oh, no, it's a special endgame cutscene. It's a special ending to Final Fantasy IV on the PlayStation. With an FMV of Full movie video on the disc of Final Fantasy IV, showing the events of the game, including for some odd reason. Oh, is that what they're saying happened? Sid jumped off the airship and the tunnel to the surface and blew up the Red Wing behind them, dropping meteors on your head. 
How did you know I love having meteors dropped to my head? Fly, Chocobo, fly. This is so nice. It's kind of nice, but I don't know. But that, ladies and gentlemen, is Let's Play Final Fantasy IV by Eclectic Andrew. I believe the credits should be coming up right now-ish. Uh, any second now. Yes, the classic ending scene to Final Fantasy IV we all know and love with space going by and the credits rolling. End of scene, fade to black, end credits, roll credits. And that will be all for today of Let's Play Final Fantasy IV. I hope you all have a good day and take care of yourselves. Until next time, goodbye.